Hi guys, this Rich Meter RM101, also known as AN8001, and some other names, doesn't have any microamp ranges. Smallest current range is 60 milliamps. In this video, I'll show how to add 600 microamp and 6000 microamp ranges to these meters with simple hardware and software modification. This is the input section for the current modes found in the DTM 0660 datasheet. The circuit in the multimeter is almost identical. J3 and J4 are jumpers that the selector switch will short depending on its position. J4 isn't included in this multimeter because there isn't any microamp mode available in this meter. Simplest way to add those microamp ranges, in my opinion, is cutting this track and connecting this side of the cut to this end of the 99 ohm resistor. After doing that, when the selector switches in amp mode, the shunt resistor is 100 ohm instead of the original 10 milliohm. That is the correct shunt value for the microamp mode with this multimeter IC. The trace that needs to be cut in this multimeter is the one going from the 10 amp fuse to these two resistors. I've already made that cut and I've already connected wire from here to here. That is the hardware part. Next there are two bytes that need to be changed inside EEPROM. To access the data on the EEPROM you need some kind of EEPROM programmer. There are many options available and you need to figure out which is suitable for you. Before the content of the EEPROM can be accessed, the VPP should be connected to ground. This keeps the main IC in reset mode and thus it won't interfere with the SCL and SDA pins. And also the multimeter should be turned on, it won't work otherwise. The two bytes that need to be changed are the ones that tell the IC to go into DC amps and AC amps modes. Those need to be changed to ones that correspond to DC microamps and AC microamps. As you may have figured out, this modification adds microamp ranges to this multimeter, but at the same time amp ranges will be lost. I hope this was useful for some of you. Like always, you are welcome to hit the like button and subscribe button if you haven't done so already. Thanks. Bye.